Everyone's excited today. This is one of those odd days, which fills me with 3.5 ml of hope. Deep down, I'm afraid. Afraid that this will evaporate as soon as it's poured into my empty aching heart. Everything was a little special that day, which made, which made my heart beat even faster. The place was a little more clean. The air was sweet, infused with burnt incense. They even prepared mouth-watering delicious dishes and gave us new dresses. These are few of the many days we children look forward to. The hesitant smile and trepidation. The days that we feel something which reminds us that we are alive too. The arrival of parents to adopt just one of us. They are coming today, we were told. In their big cars and even bigger hearts to take Ram with them to their home. It's made us wonder who will take us to our future home and when. There they come, there they come. We're all gathered in front of them and collected our sweets one after another. They caress our hair as they hand out the sweets, which leave us wanting a little more. Not of sweets, but of their caressing touch. They also had lunch with us arranged by them as a celebratory party for taking Ram with them. Later that day, they all left, all three of them, happy. I must have watched this scene a hundred times before. It gave me hope and then despair in quick succession. The tear in my eye, I asked my warden, how long should I wait for my home? She replied, your turn will come, your turn will come, Leela. I don't know when. I don't know when. This poem was uh, rendered by Pungidasa, written by Carrie, aka Karthik. Uh, I just thought of doing a spoken word of another poet, and I hope you like this. <laughs>